Oh, oh no, Morty, what kind of like, this is gonna turn into something really bad. Hey everybody, welcome back for episode nine, season five of Rick and Morty. I'm Ever, and this is the first time that I'm watching the series. If you haven't subscribed yet, make sure that you do that so that we can see the videos on day one, especially the finale, which will be next episode and next week. This next episode is titled, um, something about what is, forgetting Sarek Morchel. So, I'm assuming that this is gonna have to be a parody of Forgetting Sarah Marshall, which I've never seen, so I am not gonna recognize probably anything that happens in this, but it looks like we're just doing parodies now for the rest of the season, which there's not that many episodes left. But it's kind of interesting that we're doing that, or at least, I don't know, maybe the title, because I don't always read the titles, so maybe the titles are always just puns of, of stuff, so. I'm not, I think that, I know that sometimes they are, and then sometimes they're not, but it seems like right now, we're definitely on a streak, so I'm excited for the episode. If you guys enjoy the video, don't forget to subscribe so that we can come back and watch some other stuff along with me. Don't forget to follow me on these channels as well so that we can stay updated with the channel or just check out some of the other stuff that I've got going on, like Twitch and Discord. Thank you to all the patrons for the support. I appreciate it very much. It helps this channel run. And if you guys are interested in becoming a patron and getting early access to the seasons, including season six of Rick and Morty, or just the uncut reactions along with some other stuff, there are links down in the description below if you're interested in all that stuff. Without anything else, let's go ahead and watch episode 9. It came as a shock to me, <laughs> but with the power of activated <laughs> by the heartless consumption of our dictator, we shall impose even more draconian terrorist law. One wafers. At a time. <laughs> <laughs> and here's oh, Morty killing you. everybody. They took power immediately after you and your grandpa left. Uh, sorry about that. Rick doesn't really do transition plans. I, I think he was just hungry. Well, now with you here, perhaps a new system of government. <laughs> King Morty? Sorry, look, King I gotta Morty. Run. I'm sure you guys will figure it out. I, I believe in you. Is Morty just helping people today? Because that would be nice, actually. Morty, thank God! The beast emerged right after your grandpa. I would actually love that if Morty got to just be helpful the whole time. Son of a bitch, he marked it. Don't mix lime soda in that. Morty, why? You know better than that. Like, I know you're not a scientist, but you definitely know better than that. <sighs> what the? <laughs> oh, God. <gasps> hey, what the hell? Oh, Jesus. You got some of that green stuff on you, too, huh? Th this is bad. This is really bad. Hey, how do you think I feel? I had the ultimate stash hole, and now I got a kid in my thigh. A <laughs> kid? Oh, God. Yes, that is exactly. Oh boy, this has a lot of potential. Oh, that's great logic, Morty. Forgive me for not doing the kissy chef gesture, since you probably spilled this shit everywhere, and I don't want to teleport my lips. I, I did. I did not spill it. I won't take your word for that, and I shouldn't have to, which is why I have sidekick rules. If you can't follow <laughs> sidekick I can rules, replaced. yeah, yeah. So you yeah, we know. Me. Yeah. Excuse me. Did you just try to call my bluff? Have you ever seen me bluff? Fine. You know what? Replace me. Replace me, Rick. Just do it. Good luck finding Stop. someone that can be told eighty thousand times how replaceable they are. Okay, I'll see your bluff call and raise you reality. I can't pretend I haven't been looking forward to this. Behold, my wheel of better things than Morty. What, what are you, eight? Is this macaroni art? You expect me to believe you built this because you don't care? No, I built this because I don't expect shit from you. Come on, any... <laughs> Two crows. Two crows. Fire. You know what? Eat shit. You're just trying to make me feel worthless. I never said you're worthless. In fact, I've given you a very clear metric of your worth. Two crows. <laughs> I didn't say three. A bag of meat. I'm out. I'm walking away. Wait, Morty, don't go. Not until you see this. <laughs> Commence. Bird on a wire. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> oh, poor Morty, dude. Man, it sucks too, because Morty was just, like, helping people and everything. Like, Morty was just doing good stuff just now. Hey, they <laughs> got a visitor. <laughs> This cannot what happen to you. The guards like to beat us on Sundays. Still better than Mondays. Jeez, what happens oh. then? They lick our faces when we're tied down. Plus, it's meatloaf day. Well, you're leaving now, buddy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I, I swiped him off the guard on my way in. I, I mean, sure, yeah, I could undo my lock, but then what? After the smartest guy. You just the come through the portal in your thigh. It's fine. You could do that, right? Hey, get back oh. here. You better open this 
Oh no, Morty, what kind of like, this is gonna turn into something really bad. The more you sweat, the saltier your cheeks. Thanks, Morty. That dude's got a tongue like a cat. Yeah, no, see, like, this is one of those moments where, like, Morty thinks he's doing a good thing, and it's gonna turn into a very horrific thing. Oh, ew, ew! Holy shit, did you see that? I mean, you blinded a guy with puke. Oh, it was insane. Give That's me that. rancid. Am I doing it right? That's absolutely gonna... rancid. Absolutely not, dude. Relax. This is an avian planet with 40 million species of bird. Even one day of working under me will make you apex geniuses down there. Now hop into these pneumatic canisters they used to use at bank drive throughs in the 70s. <laughs> <sighs> Rick really just trained up some... What the... Hey, who's tractor beaming me? Nobody tractor beams me. Nobody he scrambled my tractor beam <laughs> to boot. Is it the crows? Oh, boy. Sorry for the tractor beaming, but did you lose these two crows? Oh, uh, yeah, no, I, I dropped them off because I, I can't hold a candle to them. We know? train ourselves to stop training. The train... Bro, this is really an adventure about Rick. Like... Training. Being friends with crows, like what? <laughs> this is so weird. Great, so they can put his coat away and light a joint. I mean, and then what? We are gonna shove this crow shit down Morty's throat. Oh God. Nick, Anything to hurt Morty, right? We can't do that again. Why the hell uh, not? Oh, God. Please stop breaking stuff. He's going to be so mad. <laughs> Here we go, bitch. Oh. Son, have you fallen in with a weird stranger and are now trashing your grandpa's place? Because I'll help. Uh, they're all going to die. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, yeah. Now eat my ass. Jerry. <laughs> <laughs> Jerry's just a blue blob. Who's gonna help him? I mean, it's empty, but it means the portal boys be portaling. Oh. Rick, incoming. Ah, crap. We better skedaddle. <laughs> what about my dad? He, he's like a, a puddle. You heard the garage? Rick will turn him back into a solid when he gets here. Sorry, dad, he's gonna think that it's the. Oh your car my you. God, he's gonna think that it's Jerry that did all this, isn't he? I guess the joke being that crows are stupid. But I think it's a little more nuanced than that. Right, because you just learned empathy from us. Ten minutes ago, but now we're going to learn we don't get your humor. Fucking horseshit. Yeah, there's not a ton to get, genius. The joke is your grandson was so replaceable that even uh, two crows could do it. Uh, and it's funny, except it's not. Right, well, to be honest, that is yeah, how I felt Rich at the time. But I've, I've rounded a corner. I seriously have, you guys. Well, now it's time to round the corner of death. <laughs> Let the crow evolution begin. <laughs> Yeah, this is the only outcome, right? What do you mean? It's like down here. <laughs> Cherry. Well, you don't deserve these. <laughs> Genius. Got you well a bad time. Yeah, Jerry. They took my goddamn crows. Yes. And now you want the crows? Not now, garbage goober. Get back in your hole. <laughs> here he is. This rat was skimming your crystal harvest and sending it to a spaceman named Rick. Morty Sanchez. is gonna get in a lot of uh, a lot of trouble here. We, we put a stop to that. The people of Kuntar, thank you. He's a bad guy, right? You're gonna bring him to justice. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Uh, okay. But yep, justice. Just like that. Or we could just kill you for it. <laughs> he's kidding. He's the, the portal he's boys only kill. Gotta be practice. kidding, because he doesn't guns. have anything. Oh no! No! Oh, no! Oh, no. Yep. Morty's Morty's gonna get in trouble here. Stop! Yep. Stop. <laughs> he's he. Yeah, what the fuck? Morty! <laughs> Morty! <laughs> I love that Rick just has all these body augmentations and they just like periodically come up randomly. Oh, it's me, isn't it? Oof. Let me just make sure it's not an emergency. Yellow. Rick, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I, I messed up big. Morty, it's okay. You, you can't be worse off than me. I, I got oh. splashed, robbed you, jumped into a rebound with a psycho and, and left a trail of dead. Wow, somebody's been busy. I, I did it because you hurt my feelings when, when you chose the mm. new crow. Jesus, Poor it was a Morty. Bit. My ass it's not a bit. It's his feelings, Rick. Stop! Oh! Little brat. 
You think you can fuck with me and get away with it? If you don't know this! Oh god. <gasps> Is he gonna like pull himself through the portal? Oh no, okay. I know it's a small portal, I know it'd be very difficult, but yeah. No, thank you! Pity. I can't Morty's have about to kill him. To me if you're not on my side, that means I gotta kill you! Thing is, I already got a partner, and there's no room for promotion! <laughs> <gasps> what the fuck did you just do? Cut you out of my life! What the hell, bro? See how quickly your allies abandon you, Rick Sanchez. Lucky for me, abandonment is my bread and butter. That's definitely... You can just end the episode there, really. That's not what I expected. At all. I... Morty literally just... I can't even imagine how painful that would actually be. Bro, how is this gonna end with Morty? Like, how is this gonna end with it? Oh, God. God, Morty. Here, here, come here. Let, let, let Grandpa fix you up. What do you want, a <laughs> oh. robot hand, a, a lizard hand? I can make it big again like that one time. Just my regular hand? Right, not a time for bits. I get it. <laughs> oh. Okay. I knew that obviously was gonna be fixed, but like, holy Christ. I'm a bad partner because I never made you a true partner. The crows made me see that. I thought they were a joke like you, but it turns out they're more enlightened than any of us. Oh. Okay, and, and what's the undercut? So what does that mean? Me. I will never be the same. So I need to leave with the crows and see what more they can teach me. Stop. Oh. oh. Here. I want you to have this. Oh, wow. I... You know no. what, Rick? What is... You really have changed. Well, thanks, Morty. I'll always be your grandpa, Morty. I'm just kind of obsessed with crows now. Like, for real? This isn't even the f finale? He can't li Oh, Morty. I mean, like, Morty's gonna be better off, right? Oh. <laughs> this seems like a finale. Did I mess up and... This is literally a finale bit right now. To open them. You know what I mean? Forever. Freaking two crows forever. We go on. You I am so concerned right now that that is the finale. I'm going to double check, but. <gasps> oh. Where do you think you're going? Oh, well. You <laughs> I know, love this is just the, in the their garage. Like. like Garbage. Did you seriously not talk to Rick yet? I kind of hinted at it. L look, I know it's not the job I came here for, <laughs> but it's an honest living. God damn it, Harold. What do they call you? Garbage goober? You are a doctor, for God's sake. Look, I don't know how I let this happen, but I I've let it play out so long that I can't stop now. You're a coward. <laughs> You're right. This ends here and now. Oh. Garbage goober, we got freshy trash trash for you. Extra stinky, just the way you like it. Mm, trash. I love trash. Yummy, yum, <laughs> trash. I want to eat trash. Oh <laughs> All right, there's another episode, it looks like. Oh, wow. Before we get into it, don't forget to subscribe so that way you can come back for the season finale, which I have, in fact, confirmed was not the final. This was not the final episode, but that, like, rant at the end. That's how seasons have ended, so that's kind of what I was starting to think it was. And I'm sure when this was airing, you guys probably also did, so it's kind of... Kind of scared me just a little bit, but either way, there's consequences to be had here. Um, Rick and Morty are going separate ways. How long that lasts, I don't know. It very well could last until season six. I wouldn't be shocked if they use the season finale as like their own kind of thing. So I'd be really excited to kind of see that though, because it kind of does give that sense of like, you know, what does this look like if they actually do have their own adventures or they do like break up to some degree? You know, it wouldn't be Rick and Morty without them together and everything, but it would be interesting to see and kind of explore that dynamic and I'd be very excited to see it. Overall, I still enjoyed it. I think it was just a slower episode. They could have picked a different, you know, 
person to have, not crows. And then I will say though, having Morty with the portal in his hand and everything like that whole bit, that was great. And then of course we have to talk about how he just had his arm completely obliterated by a train, which was the most, un I knew obviously with the train being right there, I knew that something was gonna happen, but I thought Morty was gonna do like a little kick and like flip him into the train or something like that. The last thing of all that that I expected was for Morty to just stick his hand out, let it be obliterated, and then have the man just suck into himself. So that was unexpected, wild, it was insane. Um, a pretty great moment, I would say in general. It was just very entertaining to see in that moment. Overall, Decent episode, I'm not mad about it, I'm not like ecstatic about it, but I would love to hear you guys' opinion as well. Seeing kind of uh, Rick also be a little bit more open and a little bit more vulnerable was also very interesting to see at the end of the episode. So I'd love to hear your guys' thoughts on it as well. If you guys enjoyed the video, don't forget to subscribe so that way you can come back and watch some other stuff along with me. And don't forget to follow me on these channels as well so that way you can stay updated with the channel or just check out some of the other stuff that I've got going on like Twitch and Discord if you're interested in those things. Thank you to all the patrons for the support. I appreciate it tremendously. I hope that you've enjoyed the early access to season five, as well as the Vindicators and all the other Patreon exclusives, along with voting on what we watch next. If you guys are interested in becoming a patron or just checking out some of that stuff, there are links down in the description below. And until next time, thanks for watching.